Galilean relativity. In 1632, in his dialogue concerning the two chief world systems, Galileo Galilei stated the principle that the laws of motion are the same in all inertial frames of reference. Provided that the frame of reference of an observer is not accelerating, the laws of physics will be followed as if the frame of reference was stationary. Galileo used the example of a ship travelling at a constant velocity on a perfectly smooth sea. A pendulum would hang vertically. In a game of pool, the balls would follow straight lines. Frames of reference. The same event can appear quite differently to observers in different frames of reference. Imagine that an observer is standing on the shore watching a ship sail past at constant velocity. Someone at the top of a mast drops an object, in this case a pair of binoculars. To an observer standing on the deck of the ship, the object appears to fall vertically. To an observer standing on the shore, however, the object will appear to follow a curved path, in fact a parabolic path made up out of a constant vertical acceleration and a constant horizontal velocity. This idea is related to Galileo's analysis of projectile motion. An object dropped from the top of the mast of a moving ship from the point of view of a stationary observer follows a trajectory similar to that of a ball rolling off the edge of a table. The image below shows a situation for a ball thrown vertically by a person on a moving cart. To an observer on the cart, the ball ascends and descends vertically as if the cart were stationary. To a stationary observer, the ball follows a parabolic trajectory like any other projectile. Galileo was able to use his understanding of relativity to refute the claims of the supporters of the geocentric theory. Supporters of this theory argued that if the Earth was in motion, then we would be able to detect it. A ball dropped from a tower would land some distance from the tower, which, being attached to a moving Earth, would move away from the ball as it fell. This was according to the teachings of Aristotle, and these had such authority that many of his ideas had come to be regarded as matters of faith by the Catholic Church. Galileo argued that, to the contrary, a ball dropped from a tower shares any velocity that the tower has due to the rotation of the earth. As the ball drops, the tower, the earth and the ball all move together. Their absolute motion cannot be measured. Only the ball's relative motion with respect to the earth and the tower can ever be detected. To say that something is moving is almost meaningless. You can only say that something is moving with respect to something else. This is the essence of Galilean relativity, otherwise known as the principle of relativity. Summary Galileo stated that the laws of motion are the same in all inertial frames of reference. An inertial frame of reference is one that is not undergoing acceleration. An observer in any inertial frame of reference cannot carry out any experiment that will detect the movement of the frame of reference. To assert that an object is moving is almost meaningless. It can only be described as being in motion relative to something else.